My fellow Spartans, good afternoon. It's a great honor to stand here today and address the graduating class of 2023. This week marks the end of our academic journey at San Jose State University and the beginning of an exciting new chapter in our lives. For some, this is exciting. For some, like me, this is very nervous. But I strongly believe that each and every one of us here will accomplish great things. Remember everything that you had to go through to be where you are today. A lot, right? Reflecting on my own time at SJSU, I remember the first time I landed in San Francisco. It was August 4th, 2021. I was filled with excitement and anticipation, but I was also equally nervous. This was the first time I was in a completely different country, all on my own. As my first semester began, I quickly realized that SJSU was a very special place. The professors were passionate about their teachings and constantly challenged everyone to think better. Programs like the I Succeed Mentorship Program taught me about the diverse student body, which was supportive and engaging. And the campus was always vibrant and alive. I still remember how I used to check the SAMI app on my phone every morning to see what all events were happening on campus and plan so that I visit all of them. I met some of my closest friends during my time at SJSU. We partied together, we did assignments together, we studied together, we had each other's back through good and bad times and we helped each other grow as people. I learned a lot during my time at SJSU. I learned about my field of study, but I also learned a lot about myself. I learned the importance of setting goals, whether it was for acing a difficult exam that we had or securing an internship at a top company. I learned that setting specific, measurable and attainable goals is crucial to success. I learned how to persevere when facing challenges. I learned how to work hard and smart and I learned the importance of community and friendship. I also learned about the importance of mental health. I learned that taking care of yourself mentally and prioritizing your mental health was very important to have a happy and successful life. Of course, the past couple of years have been unlike anything we've ever imagined. The pandemic forced all of us to adapt to new ways of learning, be it being hybrid, or online to socialize and to live. We had to be creative and resourceful, finding new ways to stay connected with our classmates and our professors while continuing working on our goals despite all these challenges. But through all that, we persevered. We showed resilience in the face of adversity and we never lost sight of our goals. And now, as we emerge from the pandemic, we are stronger and more prepared for the challenges that lie ahead of us. As we move forward, I want to remind you of all the skills that you've learned at SJSU that will serve well for the rest of your life. You've learned how to communicate, work collaboratively and think critically. You've learned how to adapt and be resilient in the face of uncertainty. And most importantly, you've learned how to persevere in the fate of adversity. So as we celebrate our achievements today, let's also remember the journey that brought us here. All those late nights staying up just to finish an assignment or finish one last presentation for your exam, all that led you to this very moment. None of that would have been possible without the constant support of our friends, families, and professors. I want to take this opportunity to thank my mom, dad, and uncle who are back in India right now for their constant support and encouragement. This would not have been possible without them. I also want to thank my friends and housemates to always bearing with me and encouraging me to do better. I also want to thank Kerry from the I Succeed Mentorship Program. SJSU would not have been uh, the same without it. In closing, I want to congratulate each one of you on, on your graduation at San Jose State University and leave you with a quote by Martin Luther King Jr. That's always inspired me to keep pushing forward. He said, and I quote, we must accept finite disappointment, but never lose infinite hope. I wish you all the best in all your endeavors, and I strongly believe and hope that every one of you will go on to accomplish great things. Thank you. Go Spartans!